this is my outfit of the day these are my leather sandals and i can't remember who they are by i will put them up on the screen these are my jeans and they are from walmart seven dollars and 78 cent and this is my ralph lawrence scratch shirt ralph so guys this is my outfit of day so let's get ready we're going grocery shopping Hi guys, welcome back to Viology. Hmm, so what's in my grocery haul? Hi guys, this is Back to Viology. I am bringing you into my grocery haul. I do major grocery shopping twice a month and this is the first part of the month. So I decided to bring you in to what I purchased on my first half of the month. I usually do grocery shopping in between the third and the fifth, and that's my first one. Then my second one is in between the 15th and the 17th. And this is how we have to roll in our household. So guys, come closer. I'm gonna show you what I purchased. Okay guys, the first thing I purchased, these are the new Tyson Waffle Bait Chicken Strips. So I got these and they were on sale at Bilo. Um, they were $8.99, buy one bag and get another bag free. This is new, this is the air fried. So I got the chicken strips. Also, I got the crispy chicken fillets. And this is the chicken nuggets. So um, I got all four of these bags and it was $17. Here, um, this is a mix of two stores. This came from Lidl's and if I'm not mistaken, it was $2.99. These are on sale at Walmart, um, sorry, at Bilo this week. And I can't remember what the price was, but I did get those. I think it was $2. They were on, their, on sale this week, two for four. And I got these because my baby girl birthday is tomorrow. So we are having not yours taco birthday party for her. So therefore I have these and they were on sale. Buy one, get one. Okay, a house is not a house without some milk. And of course, as an adult, you're only supposed to drink 2% or 1%. So I got this from Lidl's and it was $125. These, I actually love them. And I got this one for myself, which is the four cheese. And I pick up my baby girl. This one, and it's the cheese pizza. And they were on sale. I cannot remember how much. And in our household, guys, we love, love, love peppers. I do lots of stir fry in our household. So these were four for five. So I did pick up um, four of these. I still have to go and pick up um, some green ones, which I already have them on order. Um, these, my baby girl, once again, absolutely love these. So they were on sale for $6.99. So I did pick them up. For her birthday, of course, I say we're doing taco. So um, these were on sale, buy one, get one free. So I did buy two boxes. And of course, I love anything Starbucks, Starbucks, Starbucks. So these was on sale, um, buy one. No, they were half price. So I got those for $2.50, hello. And this one, my baby boy, uh, my 20 year old loves pimento cheese. So I decided to get him the real, real, real big one because he probably eat this in probably two or three days. Guys, cooking your meals, this. Uh, the onion soup dip, you use this and season your meats with it as they're cooking. It's absolutely delicious. This is one of my main seasons when I cook any meat in my household. Because we do lots of salads, I pick up the Caesar croutons. And now onto my canned goods. I cook a lot of manwich, so I like the bowl. So I did pick up three of those. I thought I'd pick up four, but I did pick up three. We love, I grew up on Allen, y'all. My mom used to buy Allen. So I got two things, Italian green beans made by Allen. And we love yams. So I did pick up two cans of yams. 
in here i love corned beef hash and i always get the reduced sodium so i did pick up two of those here um guys i buy this but let me tell you the little thing that i do with it and they are all falling um yeah it's gone i buy these guys but i add more potatoes and the beef stew beef in it and it's absolutely so good if you season this the right way it's absolutely so good um here this is brunswick stew and um my kids love it and i cook that and put it on some rice and it is delicious here um i had to pick up some more mustard and some more cooking spray and some more ketchup so those are the condiments i still have some more condiments i got to pick up here i have my brown gravy sauce fajita and i love anything grill master so this is a new one that i've never used this week mesquite and caramelized onions so yes i picked that up guys this is something new that i found in bilo it's sweet potato cake i've never ever had of it never heard of it but guys i did pick this up to go on my breakfast bar here i pick up this is the ragu butter um, I never had this Parmesan, but I got them as a little trial base and I pick up two surprise for my baby girl. Cause she always want gum for school. I only buy beef, beef, beef guys, hot dog Franks only buy beef. And I like these. They're at Lidl's and there are $4 and 59 cents. So I love those and I only buy beef. So yes, I'm a country girl. I love Souch. It's also called hoghead cheese, so it was on sale. It was a great, great, great deal, so I did pick up two of those. And chicken wings was on sale, and I am a sucker for only chicken wings. That's the only piece of meat I like on the whole entire chicken is chicken wings. So I pick up that because it was on sale. And I did pick up some chicken breasts because everybody in the house love when I do the buttermilk chicken breast sandwiches. So I did pick up these when I was in Lidl's. Yes, they were on sale, 99 cents a pound. And I picked up two of these packs of drum legs. I don't care for them, but with the onion soup, they're absolutely delicious. Here, we, two of my kids, they love livers. So I did pick up two things of chicken livers. And also back here, I did pick up chicken gizzards because I and my husband love chicken gizzards. Here, guys, are some smoke turkey which i hardly ever buy this but i was like this sounds so good to cook it down the right way and add some bear peppers and onions and some onion soup yes with some rice yes so i did pick up two of those in the end um i use these to season my green beans or i boil them down and make some perlo rice and this is the smoked neck bones and i pick up these for my baby boy he loves shrimp and he can eat it with his keto diet so i did pick up some shrimp from Lidl's. My bread, I go to the bread house and I absolutely love this bread, guys. But if you know this brand, you go in Walmart, there's $3.69 um, a loaf. And I go to the bread house, I pay $1.49. So I did pick up three. And my other son put me on Italian bread, guys. And I love this bread. It's so good. I picked that up from Lidl's and it was $1.79. So Yes, I have five loaves of bread, guys, but I do freeze my bread. And then once I get to it, I pull it out, let it unthaw, and it's ready to go. Here, um, they had this on sale at Bilo. So I pick up two of those. I have a mango punch, and also I have a tropical punch blend. And at Lidl's, guys, you know I have my coffee bar, my coffee and breakfast bar. So I did pick up some oatmeal raisin cookies, some chocolate chip cookies, and these are the egg fillers and they are so good and then i put up some um pecan braids and these are some chocolate chip little chocolate chip raisin and that's the first time i ever bought these but they were 12 cents and you get a second one for half of the price so i just pick up six of those because that was something okay new. guys you know i always tell you i keep backups just in case i have company and they want some of the drink which we don't have that much company so that's a absolutely good thing but they were on sale this week 5 for 11. so i am a sucker for anything that's blueberry so i got blueberry i got the tropical um that's not mine right there the mountain dews they're not mine 
um, the orange pineapple for my husband and I found the watermelons. So I got that one and also I got the cream. So guys, this is my grocery haul, but I do have a order that I got to pick up at three o'clock at Walmart. This was my first time guys ordering offline and guys, I, I'm old school. I like to go in the grocery store, put my hands on things, but I had a $10 off coupon. And guys, if you've never ordered from Walmart, if you go on walmart.com and order groceries and it's $50 or more, you will get $10 off. So the things that I know is heavy for me and if my boys are not with me, I can't pick it up and my husband is at work. So I was smart. I'll order my cases of water. I am a sucker for grapefruit juice. So I'll order 10 things of grape, um, grapefruit juice um the hawaiian drinks the big thing i ordered some of those so the cool thing about that the only thing i do is pull up at walmart on the terminal they tell me to park at and i hit my locks let them put it all in the back of my truck and i'm off i just have to wait to get home and someone to take it out because it won't be me i bought it you get it so guys um i might show you what it's in my Walmart haul. Once they put it in my truck, I might just film it right there to show you what's in my Walmart haul. And this is it. So this is like, some of this food will carry past the two weeks because a lot of stuff that probably won't even be touched. But um, I still have to get some more frozen vegetables. I got to get eggs. Um, guys, when it comes down to my dairy, I'm sorry. I don't want anyone going in the store and picking up my vegetables my fruits and my dairy products so at walmart when i pick up my order i got to go in to get my eggs i got to go pick up my sour cream my cottage cheese cheese um green peppers things like that i go in and i purchase i pick it up myself because i don't want somebody else touching my stuff like that and i am one guys i don't believe in picking up things in the front those are your frontal items anything that is three items it well let me put this way that's cold items anything that are three items to the front i would not purchase because your doors open and close open and close as people purchasing things and pulling things so therefore even with that the date behind the first three items the date's gonna last you longer so therefore i'll always always make sure that I pick up the third item before I had to, I don't want to say train, but I had to explain that to my husband. If you go in the store and you pick something up for me, please, please, please. If it's cheese, if it's, if it's cheese or anything like that, I want it from the back. And it's a reason. The dates are different and it's, it's not temperature control. The, as they're moving and somebody picking up something, the, the, the temperature is doing this to it. So therefore, it's not going to last as long as you pull it from the back. So guys, um, I'm going to film once I get to Walmart and they come in and they load me up. I might film that for them loading me up. So guys, um, just stay tuned when I get to Walmart. <laughs> 